Hello. I've been in Australia for three years. I'm not married. I have no children. I love to swim. I'm a student and this is my friend's story. My community is made up of mostly refugees. We were told during the AUSCO sessions at the refugee camp that in Australia, men are not allowed to hit women or children, that Australia supports the human rights of women. When we arrived in Australia, we attend orientation sessions and we were told about domestic and family violence and child abuse. The men became very upset because in our culture, a man can discipline his wife and children. The man is the authority in the family. They control the woman and the children. Women have to look after their husbands, children and family. Their priority are their husbands and family. Divorce is not allowed. Women who are divorced are looked down upon by others, so women often keep their pains secret, unless they fear for their children. Sometimes women see their potential in Australia to separate and the men are fearful of that. So they enforce their authority even more as they feel the threat to their authority. Newly arrived spouses only report the violence to their family overseas, specifically their mothers, sisters, where they are advised to stay in the relationship and make it work. Sometimes the relatives refer to their own experiences and how they worked hard to make it work. Sometimes they tell you that it is the way of men and women need to learn how to live with it. This is very difficult advice to live with. The women and their relatives know that there is no excuse for violence. This makes a woman feel very helpless and will need a lot of support to get out of such relationship.